Hello, my name is Robert Dean Steele, and today we're talking about rest. Listen to this quote. To overcome stress, enjoy a day off. Jesus suggested in Matthew chapter 11, 31, from the Living Bible, Jesus suggested, let's get away from the crowds for a while and rest. For so many people were coming to and going, they scarcely had time to eat. You know, God modeled rest for us in creation. He created the world in six days, and then he rested on the seventh. Why? Was he tired? No. He simply wanted to touch, uh, teach us the importance of being refreshed by resting. If it's good enough for God, it should be good enough for you and me. Unfortunately, many times we push the limit. We work too long during the day, and we work too many days in a row. Listen to what David writes in Psalm 23, verse number two. He says, he makes me lie down in green pastures. Have you ever had to make your children lie down? <laughs> They're so wound up that you have to force them to rest. Yet we never make ourselves take a rest and follow that example. Although you may take a regular day off during the week, you still feel required to do something, your honey-do list. Well, you know what? Maybe we should just take the day off. You know, relax, read a book, do something that is beneficial to our health and also to our well-being. You see, we need to recognize that we all need to rest. You know, having a good night's sleep is actually a wonderful way to restore your body and your health. So take time off, take rest. If you're burning the candle at both ends, you're not as bright as you think you are. Quit playing super person and delegate. Also today, spend time with your family on those days off, with your spouse. Do something that will make you rest and take time to rest. My name is Robert Dean Steele.